Here at home, East Texas University officials say this, this decision could help student athletes cover the rising cost of going to college. Yeah, KETK's Frank Jefferson tells us how local athletic directors are reacting to the new ruling. At first glance, the Supreme Court's new ruling looks like it only affects student athletes in our area who play basketball and football at Stephen F. Austin State University. Despite SFA being the only Division I school in East Texas, the impact of this decision extends beyond the big name schools. And, and this is probably the first major domino to drop at a, at a federal level. Kevin Vest, the athletic director at Tyler Junior College, says the high course decision could be a game changer. A, a change in the landscape of intercollegiate athletics. I think we've been seeing this come uh, down the pike for several months. Other sports leaders in East Texas say this could transform how they recruit. And, and every student athlete out there that's listening or hears this, any school that recruits you, they, you should ask them, what can you do for me? past the scholarship part of this. And just to reiterate, this is not about colleges paying athletes for their name, their likeness, and their image. This has to do with educational benefits, and that's paid internships, getting postgraduate scholarships, and school equipment like laptops. It's less than 1% of all college student athletes are gonna play professionally, and so we need to do our part to make sure we are preparing them to be successful in life after, life after athletics. Many of our local athletic officials are siding with the students, pushing for their continued success past their programs. We believe now this ruling prepares the way for name, image, and likeness from an NCAA standpoint, and, and hopefully we'll have some of that those answers here within the next couple of weeks. I just think, you know, there's going to be some folks that come out and, and think this is the, the end of, you know, college athletics. No matter how you feel about the Supreme Court decision, this is the beginning of a new day in college sports. Frank Jefferson, KETK News. Governor Greg Abbott recently signed a bill into law allowing Texas college athletes to profit off their name. Now, Texas is one of dozens of states giving students the green light to make money from their hard work in and out of the classroom.